Superintendent and his team. I mean, there is inspectors, there's concrete testing. We have a lane closed on Collins Avenue on a Friday night. Yeah, everything's planned, the food, the water, the rest, the people coming uh, for the next shift. There's 160 trucks that are going back and forth to 11 different plants in Miami and Broward counties. And, uh, and the traffic pattern and the police. I picked something, so I did my homework too. I think a lot of the guys are feeling the pressure of, and the long hour, but uh, the daylight has certainly helped get them woke back up and uh, they swap out some of the guys that's been doing some of the heavier work and get some new fresh bodies in here. So go ahead and finish this thing off. I have to take my hat off to the crew here. They, they've been right on time. They've been very safe. Uh, I've had minimal complaints for, from uh, the neighbors. Uh, this has been one of the cleanest jobs that, that we have here. They clean every vehicle before it leaves the property. And I know this is gonna be ultimately successful. Uh, we have a lot more ground to open up here, and uh, I, I look forward to that. Right now, you, we've got two, three finished crews going, starting on the south end, and we're going to work our way north. You can see they're still placing, going north. Um, they just started bolt floating. Once it starts to firm up, they'll put the machines down on it and start the real finish. bought a, a good finish on this. They're gonna you know, seal it up with the machines and put a fine broom on it. And the reason we wanted to do that is really twofold. I think we want to show you know, the ownership and anyone coming into the job that we really care, even though we don't need to care so much about this as far as appearance. We want that transmitted throughout the whole job and everyone who steps foot in here. I want them to know we care because we do. 